the story of the jackal and the drum once a jackal called gomayu was wandering through the forest in search of food he had not had a good meal in days and was desperately hungry in a remote corner of the forest he came upon a forgotten battlefield where once two armies had fought and died the battlefield lay deserted now though the ground was still strewn with the debris of war gomayu looked around him with interest perhaps he would be able to find something to eat here even an old bone or two would do all at once he heard a sound a deep booming rumble such as he had never heard before gomayu jumped and trembled with fear hey what sound is that he cried it must be a monster who will eat me in a bite i better get out of here as quickly as i can and turning around he made to run back into the trees but wait a minute he then said to himself why should i run away after all i am a reasonably clever fellow and i'm sure i can work out who or what is making this sound maybe i don't need to be frightened at all and gomayu turned back towards the battlefield he made his way carefully across the field stepping gingerly through the broken swords and spears that were strewn all over the ground till at last he saw what was making that deep and frightening rumble it was a huge old battle drum lying where it had fallen amongst the grass and bushes every time a gust of wind shook the branches of a nearby tree they tapped against the face of the drum and the drum boomed and rumbled otherwise it lay still and silent gomayu heaved a sigh of relief this was no fierce beast he went closer and tapped it with his paw at once the drum gave out a loud rumble this thing is so round and fat i'm sure it must be stuffed full of meat and blood thought the jackal ah i'm so hungry something to eat at last and forgetting his fears of a moment ago he fell upon the drum and began to gnaw and chew till at last he had made a hole in the drum side he peered through the hole expecting a feast but the drum was as empty as his tummy the jackal shook his head in disappointment how silly of me he thought how could i imagine that there would be food lying around for me to find this is no fearsome beast and no magic ladder it is just a silly old drum and laughing at his own foolishness he turned around and ran off into the forest Thank you for attending this session. Do share and subscribe to this channel for more lessons like this. Check out other video lessons by clicking on the video